struggling to get that perfect pork crackle, then this could be the video for you. But don't forget everything to the video today. There are links in the description below for the best place to get those barbecue products. Make sure you check those out at the end of this video. Hi Weber fans, welcome back to the channel. So in today's video, we're gonna be cooking a pork roast. You can get the perfect pork crackle from a frozen pork roast joint. We're gonna enhance this pork with some awesome flavors. So let's dive in and have a look. Before we jump to today's video, you're gonna to wanna to set up your Weber Q in the convection cooking system. So you're gonna want a trivet for that. There will be a link down below of where to get these from. So let's get this barbecue lit and then jump in and start preparing our pork. Right, so we've got a 2.4 kilo roast. This has defrosted overnight, so it's a frozen pork roast joint. We've dried it off, had it in the fridge overnight, so we're gonna season it up now and then start preparing that crackle. So today we're going to use the Weber Greek seasoning. It will be linked down below where to get this from. So make sure you check this out at the end of this video. So we're going to give that a dry now with some more paper towel. Make sure it's totally dry. It's literally got wet as we were turning it over from the meat itself. Just make sure that skin is perfectly dry and it will render absolutely awesome. Now let's dry, let's get that pork crackle prepared. But don't forget everything to the video today. There are links in the description below for the best place to get those barbecue products. Make sure you check those out at the end of this video. Right, so as you can see, that pork turned out superb with that Weber Greek seasoning. It tastes amazing. Just make, puts a massive enhancement on your pork roast. You can use this on poultry, beef. It's a perfect addition to any type of meat. And also you can see that ink bird has triumphed again to give us the perfect pork roast joint. There will be a link down below to those Weber seasonings. Now, if those of you are looking for the best thermometer for your Weber grill, check out this video next and for those of you struggling to clean your Weber Genesis check out this video next so thanks for watching happy grilling and I'll catch you next one